Peace and prosperity be to all who's listening and watching. It's your girl, Lachey Marilla Wright, and I'm back with another video. And today, I just want to say thank you guys for subscribing. We are all at a thousand subscribers. Thank you to everybody who's supporting my channel. If you truly are inspired by what I do, I'm so glad that you enjoy it just as much as I'm happy to make the content. I love you guys. I have a whole bunch of content for you guys. I have pages worth of content for you guys. So... I would never run out of ideas nor content to make uh today i just want to talk to you guys about plagues plagues and how is many plagues you got you got plagues of disease and you got plagues of injustice you know as many you got plagues of self-destruction you got plagues of Hey, how are you guys? How are you doing today? Uh, I just want to say that it's amazing to be alive. Though it's a lot of misunderstandings while you're living. You have a lot of amazing moments to, you know, look back over on and appreciate. Uh, I think this, what this moment right now, like what is teaching everybody and, you know, people who also are prepared. It teaches you that. You know, many unexpected things are happening in this life. And, and then, you know, there's many things that are going to come to happen, you know, even after this is passed. You know, after this is over and done, you know, more things are to come, you know. We, we went through so many periods of changes in, you know, the universe. You know, one minute it was just like police brutality and uh, the missing of women and just a whole bunch of different stuff going on around the world and now we're at a halt <laughs> it's like winter time we're like at a halt and the season is just like nothing's growing everybody's just like at a stop everybody's very focused on social media and you know getting their businesses out there getting themselves you know known um you know uh trying to be an entrepreneur really working hard on themselves uh, for those who are really focused and want to be better and have a greater life we really are focused on our ambitions and our admirations and you know how many of you guys have uh affirmations that you say every day i have affirmations that i say every day i'm gonna make a video on the affirmations that i say or the affirmations that i you know i could suggest that you could say the things that you say basically is like a, a reflection of who you are but basically what you want to attract same with your companion or your partner it's basically a reflection of you and what you attract so you attract basically who you are and i'm not saying because you're good bad things don't happen to you i'm not saying because you're bad good things will happen to you i'm just saying that you are ultimate attraction of who you are and what you desire and what you think so all these things attract the law of attraction is really important in obtaining things but also the law of action you have to be an action person you have to be somebody who is going for it and moving towards what they want you have to have consistency you have to be focused you have to know what you want you got to be on top of it always remember when achieving dreams stay on top of it i know it gets hard and things get you know clouded but you should always remember that despite discouragement you should be encouraged to help other people and you know fulfill your dreams because there's no greater disappointment than oneself you know anybody everybody around can disappoint you because you put high hopes in them you put high expectations on them but when you disappoint you that's a whole nother story that was just you not falling in on your um your actions you know somebody else not falling in on their word that was because you put too much hope into them don't expect people to fulfill promises. Don't ask people to make promises. Don't put high expectations on people. If you don't have high, high expectations on yourself, don't put high expectations on others. You know, be the reflection of what you desire. And you can have what you want. But you shouldn't expect people to be like you. You should expect people to be everything that you are a reflection of. Everything that your actions project. Everything that you want. You know, your actions should be the proof of your manifestation, your your lived out thoughts and you should always want to be better a thousand times better than you were yesterday anyways i hope you guys are having a phenomenal day 
uh, thank you for all the subscribers. Thank you for all those who really support. I'm so glad that my channel has been helping you all. Thank you for the positive feedback. I love it. I love it. Keep it coming. I have a lot of more amazing ideas for you guys. So keep in tune. You know, I post a video every single day, whether it be one or two. I'm going to get to the point where I have a certain time where I post them, if I can be committed to that. But the thing with commitment is you, you got to want to be committed to certain times. I think that's limiting my creativity because, you know, I'm really more creative later in the day than I am, you know, early. So I don't want to put a limit on my creativity. So give myself a time limit to when I could put something up. You have to be mindful. If you're a creator or artist or somebody, never limit yourself. If you're going to post a video, of course, post a video every single day like you say. You don't have to, have to always have a particular time. Yet, you should know when people are up and out and on YouTube watching. So post it when they're up and watching. Okay? Don't put high expectations on you and limit your creativity and your ability to do. Okay? Love yourself. Think about your well-being, your mental health, your stability, and... I pretend to fit in, guys. Be yourself. Love yourself. Know yourself. Uh, you know, take care of yourself. And you don't have to follow every trend. You don't have to become a trend. I mean, yeah, it's good to set your own um, trademark. It's good to have your own brand. It's good to have your own business. It's good to live it. You know what I'm saying? You know, you can't live a trend. You know, trends change. They come and go. We change, yes. But the thing about trans is like tradition. People wanted to stay around, but it can't. And a part of being a part of the trend is not being yourself. So trend individuality, trend uniqueness, trend be you. Love yourself and let's have a tremendous day. Be happy with who you are. Never let anybody put you down. You're always gonna be amazing no matter what anybody says. Remember that. Write it down. I don't care how you got to remember that. You are amazing no matter what anyone else says. And no one can ever change nor dictate that. Words can never be the justification of who you are, nor could that be the dictation of your life. Only you can define who you are. Remember that. Sleep on it. Wake up. Be happy. Choose happiness because at the end of the day, happy is a state of being. You have to find inner peace within yourself. You can't ever let everyone else around you define your happiness. And you must be happy. Live for you. Live for those you love. And be the one to make the change. Change starts within. And the greater the change with you, the greater the change in this universe. Because if you can change, anything in this world is possible to change. Huh.